drunk as me. I am drunk. Everybody sing along. Wee! Silence like a premature. Fire of the beer song. Usually savor that one for uh, Fridays alone, my friends. And you get too much of the beer song? The answer is no. The answer is hell no. As we are talking beer, 719 day. Uh, right around the corner, of course, July 19th. Hook up with us for the 719 day brew fest as we'll be doing it live from Switchback Stadium. And, uh, yeah, teaming up with but Vapor Source, our friends at Jackson's Mixed Martial Arts Association, Vintage Grooming Company, uh, Black Falcon School of Arms. They literally sell arms. Wait, no, I'm sorry. They do sword fighting. Uh, Yellow Cab on board, Switchback, and then uh, John Eddie Productions helping uh, out as well. John in the house. What's going on there, buddy? Good morning, buddy. How are you? Hey, amigo. Good. Uh, you got the beer crawl ready to I go mean, for the day? Yeah, this is, this is really exciting, getting ready for our first beer. Uh, brewery crawl happening this afternoon uh we're going to get things started at uh, at local relic uh at about uh, 3 30 3 45 uh they don't have a tap room and that's one of the really exciting things about going there first uh because we're just going to be hanging out uh, actually in the brewery uh and then we're going to be going down to bristol and swing into uh, several downtown uh breweries we're going to be hitting triple s iron bird field house uh so come on with us You'll be uh, getting updates on social media, John Eddie Productions on uh, on Facebook. We'll have all of that. Uh, but the Tough brewery day at the field. office, huh, John? Hey, man, you know Tough someone's got to do it. It's time. it's. Uh, I mean, it's going to be five o'clock somewhere. That's somewhere maybe East Coast, <laughs> but uh, you know, three thirty seems to be our five o'clock. I do to give till I bleed, my friend. Y- yes, you know, you it's, know, all I, the, it's all uh, for the common cause. good. Yeah, all, all for the common good. <laughs> and seven one nine day. We're we're getting really excited about this. I mean, it's hard to believe it's two weeks away. Right. Uh, and you know, for your 35 bucks, you come on in, you get your tasting mug, uh, you, you get your 12 local breweries. Can't stress that enough. Everybody brews in the 719 and our one distillery, same right, same thing right here at Powers and right. Galley. Everything is local right here in our community. Uh, you've got contest chances to win a uh, combination of a, a thousand bucks in cash and prizes from Vintage Grooming Company just for having the most rockin' beard. The top three get cash and prizes from Sweet. Vintage Grooming. Where you mentioned Black Falcon School of Arms, they're actually going to do an arm demonstration. It's going to be with weapons, though. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, we're going to be giving away <laughs> tickets to go see corn for the best cornhole player. Yeah, yeah. Practice up your skills. Brush up on your cornhole and skills. And your beer pong. What if you want to go see Weezer with limo transport, we're going to be giving that away. If you're the best beer pong player, uh, and we've got local bands, Sound Studies, Ghost Radio coming on out, Mark's Midnight Studies coming out to rock for us. All local about us, and that's the coolest thing. More information uh, on the Kilo website, and uh, of course, JohnEddyProductions dot com, which I know everybody has bookmarked. Yeah, link up easy <laughs> enough. Um, some of these cats uh, ran into at the uh, Moonlight on the Mountain at the zoo. Some of these breweries were out there for that one. We got lucky enough, we got, we got rained in at the Red Leg Tent. Uh, life we is hard, man. Rained in anywhere, the Red Leg Tent's where you want to be. Life life is really hard. And you bring one of our uh, fine local brewers in from the Eastern Plains. Really, really lucky uh, that we got uh, Jack's Brewing on board uh, and Kyle, who does a killer job, uh, working, working over at Jack's, uh, getting to tell us a little bit about what they're doing. Hey, Kyle, what's going on? Welcome to the show. Awesome. Thanks for coming in so early. Well, thank you. Not a problem. It's and not that bad, you know. Uh, of course, you come up with the first thing is, like, where would you get the name? I, I I figured that out by myself, huh? <laughs> you did. Who's the big boy? I'm the big boy. <laughs> so, Jax comes from the three owners. Yes. It's J-A-K-S. I was like, hmm, that's yes. an odd spelling. There's got to be something there. Something behind it, yes. And There's it is. Meaning. So it's uh, Jeff, Antonio, and Ken, the first letters of their first name. Boom. And mm-hmm. just th- three beer hounds that uh, realized there was no product in Peyton and mm-hmm. were smart enough to think, hey, we're sick of driving. Let's make our own beer, damn it. Yep. Trying to bring the love of craft beer to Falcon Peyton area. Which that whole area is boomed. And it is cool. It's a very uh, like-minded uh, community. You have people who, who want some space. Uh, for their four wheelers or their motorcycles or horses, mm, yep, active bunch, and they uh, consuming the beer at yeah. record oh, paces. Yeah. <laughs> they love the beer, which is good. Uh, we've only been open for about a year and okay. three months, but we have a good following, and um, it's the community that really helps us kind of keep going and do well. And what are you bringing to the party here for Seven One Nine Day? So for Seven One Nine, we are bringing our raspberry wheat. Which is a white wheat that's topped with fresh raspberries, real good, seven percent. It's the new thing too. It's that you know it used to be a uh, wheat beer which regimented to you know to be a four percent maybe if you're lucky. Mm-hmm. Ooh, it's a five point two. 
loading up some of these uh, wheat beers, which is that's my favorite kind of beer. Oh yeah, but it's always you know oh it's always underperforming considering some of these uh, IPAs now that are you know pushing tens and stuff mm-hmm. like that. So you roll in at what with that? Seven percent. Yeah. See? Fully loaded, a little bit of punch. It'll get you with a in a good way. With a crisp laughter taste. And then the other will be what? The other one is going to be our Jackalope Double IPA. All the raids, them IPAs, huh? Mm-hmm. So that one's good. That one's about 7.6%. Yeah, how, how, uh, how big on the IBU scale? It's at a, let's see, I think a 47. Perfect. Yeah, 47 of you. Right there. So it's not it's like one of those Double Dog Dare IPAs? No, it's not one of those... Hop head, all you taste is hop for the rest of your life. So that's the thing that's almost like when, <clears throat> when hot sauces was the rage a couple of years ago. It's like, I'm going to have the hottest sauce that will leave me with no taste in my mouth right. ever. Burn and, all your taste buds off. Right. <laughs> and the same thing with these IPAs sometimes now. They're just like loading it. Come on, guys. Keep it down the middle. No, it's good. It's got a nice floral nose, but you still got that hop kind of burn on the back of your tongue yeah. that you're looking for in an IPA, but you still get a full kind of flavor profile. Uh, Jacksbrewing.com, if you uh, want to find out more, you said to your Facebook, you'll also... Uh, Superfly, that's yeah. the best the number one place Superfly to go. Superfly Facebook page. And J-H-A-S. On tap, well, what's the number one beer out there in Peyton? Oh, number one beer? What do you think? It's hard. Well, do you have a favorite? I have a favorite. Kyle's favorite so is? My favorite is our Old Dirty Blonde Pale Ale. Old Dirty Blonde reminds me of an old girlfriend, as a matter of fact. Oh, <laughs> do tell. Uh, John <laughs> stole her. Oh, man, John. It's a long story. He'll be dragging around to the beer crawl later on today. <laughs> Pale Ale was <laughs> delicious, by so, the way. A fresh wound <laughs> still, Kyle. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't know. I didn't and tell then, me. Where do they find you? Folks in Peyton, I'm sure, already know where you are at. But what if someone uh, like myself wants to track you guys down? It's easy. You take Woodman all the way down east until you see a safe way. And then you take a left. <laughs> Look and it's safely. right next to the Sonic okay, in the so corner. It's, it's in that little Falcon shop. It is area. where everything is in Falcon. That's where it is. Okay. <laughs> in, in my mind, for a reason, I had like a, a picturesque, like you know, some wooden shed on a prairie farm. You know what I mean? A rainbow in the background. Oh, of course. Like that. With a waterfall. You have to yeah, cool. Have a password to get in the game. So you want uh, you beer? You find yourself there in uh, Peyton and Falcon. That's the place to stop. Jack's Brewing. Absolutely. And, uh, we try in a couple of their beers. It's seven one nine day now. Two weeks. Two weeks out. I can't believe we're almost there. Uh, again, more details. Go to Kilo943.com. All the uh, prizes are listed. All the uh, full list of brewers are there. Check out uh, John and the gang rolling through. What time are you you're starting? We're get, getting started about uh, 3.30, 3.45. We'll hit Local Relic. All right. Local Relic for about what? how much time? for? We're going to go about 20 minutes at each brewery, so we'll so go. 20 and then 40. Yeah. And, then, <laughs> and then 60. And then three hours. hours. And then, and then, and then we'll see how long it takes for the cab to get there. And that's that's pretty like, much how that's going. What happened? <laughs> uh, that is the score, my friends. Vapor Source, thanks for uh, your support. Uh, it's Jackson's Mixed Martial Arts Association, uh, Vintage Grooming Company, the Black Falcon School of Arms, Yellow Cab, and the Switchbacks Football Club, all a big part of 719 Day Brewfest. We should have the swordsmen fight the martial arts guys. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that would be a sight. I right? pay for that. This what? is why you're in the chair, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I just you got the good ideas. Think, is it too late to get that hooked up? I mean, that, that's better than the beard contest. <laughs> we, got, we got two weeks. Two weeks is enough time to do anything. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, 35 bucks will get you in. 45 bucks for an extra hour of uh, beer time. Coming up here on uh, the 19th, 719. Get it? Um, that's it. Thank you very much, Jax, for swinging by. We'll see you here in two weeks. Absolutely. Thanks for having us. Good enough. Uh, 918 now here on the Kilo Morning Show.